Hello and welcome to another Blender Vision tutorial um, where you can find a no-nonsense direct step-by-step -step approach to getting your tasks done. I'm Richard, you're you and this time we're going to be looking at applying multiple textures to the same surface. Ooh, exciting stuff coming up. Okay, so if you followed the texture and basics tutorial, you should have a brick wall like this. If not, you should watch that one first or just make your own. Sir, yes, Nothing sir. too fancy smancy. Sir, yes, sir. Don't make mine look bad. <laughs> just a basic wall. Yes, so, so what we're going to do now is add another texture on top. We're going to make it look like graffiti. So I have prepared a texture, obviously. You need to do that first. Ooh, so if you've got GIMP or Photoshop, whatever you use, go and do that first, and then carry on with this video. So we're gonna with this wall selected, we're gonna tab into edit mode first, and we're gonna select the face that we want the graffiti to be on, which is going to be this front face. So with a face selection tool, we're gonna select the front face. We're gonna go up to here at the top we're going to add a new texture oh, no. oh sorry we're going to add a new material first by pressing this little plus button and then we're going to select the same material as the first one but now we're going to press this plus button which makes a duplicate so it's now a new material so it's wall material 001 so we can leave it named that we don't really care so now with this front face uh, with only this front face selected or the face that you want the graffiti to be on you want to press assign with that selected so that is now assigned to that material while the rest of them assigned to the first material so over in the textures tab we're going to make a new texture as well by clicking new and then we're going to scroll down we're going to say open and we're going to find our graffiti there we are mine is there and as you can see, it is on the wall, but it is repeated. We do not want that. So we're going to scroll down to image mapping, click that. And where it says extension, it says repeat. We're going to change that to clip. Now, this doesn't change anything in the 3D viewport. I don't understand why, and I can't figure out a way to, to get it to disappear. But when you render, it will only show one. But first, because it will show nothing at the moment. We need to go down to UV ed Editor, and we want to select, because it's only got that one wall selected, we want to select our FOV spray, and we need to bring this wall over roughly where we want it. So we go for around the middle. So this is where it gets tricky, because there's so many up here, you're not sure which one is, is the actual one. I think it's going to be this one, because it's in the middle. So let's press Render, and there it is. Now because we've got the normal switched on for the bricks, you can see the brick surface coming through the well, spray paint or the texture there. So it makes it look like a spray paint this is actually sprayed on the surface. So it gives that cool effect. Now there's some other things you can play around with on here. You can see that that's looking nice there. If you scroll down to the bottom here, you can click negative for example. And it gives a equally awesome effect but white or oh, you can have a look at these blend options here right now it's mix you can change it to subtract or add I think add usually looks pretty cool look at that that looks pretty genuine like real real spray doesn't it let's move back a little because the pics the uh, resolution isn't great look at that, that looks like legit spray there doesn't it so you can play around with these settings here I think saturation is pretty decent as well there you go and it's that easy, you just follow those steps and put two, you can put more as well, you can put another one on top as well and just play around with that and see what you can come up with. I'm sure it'll be awesome. So there we are. So that's it. For this one I take you get the picture, or multiple pictures. <laughs> Okay, so don't forget to like and subscribe for more no-nonsense step-by-step tutorials on probably the world's best 3D imaging software the world has ever seen in the world. Or something.
கபடி குக்